What is going on, you guys? It is your boy, MC here. Guys, we are here with the season finale. We have made it. The season finale of My Hero Academia Season 7. This season has been an absolute roller coaster, which we all saw that coming. Anybody going into the second part of this war and the final arc of this show knew exactly what they were getting themselves into. And I can speak so much about this season, but I am not going to do that right now because I am so excited and I am so curious on how they're going to do the season finale. Because I already said even last time where I'm not obviously expecting anything with Bakugo. I don't really even kind of need to if I know what they're going to give me in this episode, which it is all for one versus all might. It is round two between these two. We have not seen this since obviously the very last time All Might was ever freaking active in this show back in season three. Let's see what's going to happen, man. I really don't know what's going to happen. I don't know how, even though this feels obviously like maybe like a cliffhanger is probably going to happen, but it feels like the middleweight point of obviously the final season. And I know I put it out. The final season is confirmed for next year. I have a lot to say about that, but I don't know if I'm going to go into it in a video or a stream. I don't know. There, there's going to be a lot to talk about with this season, so I'll maybe do a stream. But that will be another video for another day. But right now, season finale, I don't know what's about to happen. I know in the last episode, Toga and Uraraka, one of the best episodes of the season. I could definitely say that. It was visually telling, visually beautiful. A lot of really good things to take away from that episode. And I really wonder how their relationship is going to kind of go now. I really, really wonder for the amount of times where they've almost had a misunderstanding between each other, especially Uraraka, finally getting to understand who this girl actually is and what she's been dealing with. How in the world is it going to affect them going for it. even though i know her and of course dobby are going to be probably going to tartarus after all this is done like i just i'm curious where the relationship's going to kind of go the relationships with everything that's going on the todoroki family her and toga and all this stuff but let me shut up and let's get straight to hell into the season finale you guys came here for one thing and that's one thing that i'm going to give you guys i just cannot believe we've made it and next year it is gonna end at least with the anime but that's at least what i'm gonna say right now season finale time all for one versus all might we're about to see what he's gonna be looking like in this suit so without further ado let's get straight the hell into it if you guys are new to the channel you guys like my reaction like subscribe comment down below and if you guys when you notified on release those videos make sure to smash that notification bell but with that being said let's get right into the season finale of my hero academia last episode was insane Visually telling, a lot of story being told, backstory. Everything that Uraraka has been wanting to know since the last season, ever since she first took her on. I did also hear something about the Uraraka actress actually crying during her lines. That does not surprise me. I saw the manga panels and everything. And okay, I saw so many people with the domain expansions. Calm the hell down. There is the last of twice we will ever see him in this show. Ever. God. Oh, man. Look at Endeavor, dude. Look at all that. It looked like everybody got... <laughs> We're seeing a freaking Infinity War moment right now. I know some people can say that. Wow. That close. God damn. So much with Hawks too. Not having a power anymore. Maybe that's just at least for right now. Who knows? Hmm. Oh. oh okay i you know what i was maybe thinking about this but i was not expecting it to actually happen wow which i mean it's great <laughs> she won't she's lost a lot of blood though 
A lot of blood. There's no way she's obviously dying. Oh, is wait, is she gonna help her? Is Toga maybe gonna help out or is at least help Uraraka? She's literally bleeding out. Uh-huh. I don't even know if there's even a league anymore. <laughs> is she gonna help her? Oh. Ah, I know what she's doing. Wow, yeah, that's a smart way of doing that. Very, very smart. Damn, and that's still causing her a lot of pain. Wow. It's a really good moment, man. Just like insane character arc for both of them. What? What? He did. You don't have to do everything that you just did. <laughs> but instead, she did all of that. <laughs> wow, there's a lot happening right now. Hmm. She at least apologized. Mm. That's a nice line, though. It's deep inside him. Still talking about Shigaraki. Oh, wow. I never thought we would ever get to this point with both of them. Ever. Is this it? Oh, shit. Wow, holy shit. What a character arc. That's all I can really say right now. Oh shit, is she gone? Wow. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh, fuck. I don't even know what I'm ready for. Oh, God. That was changed, though.
Let's see the transformation. Let's see. What a shot! Oh my god, look at this! Yo! What is this, like, nanotech shit? What in the world? Yo, look at the CG right now. I know. All the people have been waiting for this shit. What the fuck? Oh my god. Armored All Might. Dude, his armor looks great. Recording. Oh my god, it looks amazing. It is. You better stream that shit. Hey man, for real. They haven't seen all my in a, like in over a year. Look at him! Oh my god! She ain't gonna do that, really? I mean, all the cameras and everything are on Shigaraki and Deku, so why the hell not? Look at this. He's just looking straight the hell at him. God, I still remember four years ago seeing this fight. Me being on the edge of my seat. Four years later, I'm now seeing round two. Oh, he's doing more than that! Yo. Oh my god. Breaking down buildings and everything. Where is he at, though? He is fast! 66. No matter what, he is never going to stop smiling. What? Oh, technically, what? Oh my god! Oh my god. Nice. This is totally different. The impossible has now just become possible. That's what's just happened. By Melissa! Hey, man! God damn, let's go, man. Let's go. Oh, this is bringing me back. Oh, this is bringing me back, man. For real, it is. Wow. Yo, he is using most of freaking one ace quirks. How in the world shoot style? What the fuck? Oh my god! Constantly going! <laughs> And he's still being hilarious as shit. All for one, he's getting his shit kicked in. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're about to have one of these moments again. Where his- oh my god. Oh, I knew he was gonna throw something. Damn! Alright, he just got laid down, I don't know, 10, 15 blocks? How did that do with the suit? Ah, oh, shit. Oh my god. 
Wow, I just want to know all that just went into this suit, man. That's him already? What the fuck? Are you putting on a trash bag? Wow. <laughs> I want to see a movie like that, man. I, I do. Oh, shit. Oh, being able to throw. Did that do anything? No. Yo, what the hell? You know what? Why am I even questioning with him? Oh, support. Yo. You call me trash, right? Oh, My hero, you're going you're getting into your bag, man. You really, really are. I'm just waiting for it to hit that next gear, man. I'm I'm feeling it. He was so like Deku. He was so like Izuku back then. Wow. Oh my god, what I know that's him. Holy shit. This ain't getting good. <laughs> Ribs fracture. Ah, shit. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Stop with this shit, man. Come on, man. Oh, man. Of course he doesn't. He doesn't probably give a damn. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that's really much what we've been saying for the past couple episodes. The more you do, the more he gets younger. Still smiling and laughing. Oh my. Yo, this. I don't. I don't really know what to say right now. I really don't. Yo. Oh my god. What is. What? 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 Is, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I can't even say anything. What the hell? Everybody out. What is gonna happen? All my literally having almost all of a mix of their quirks. I don't know what is about to happen. How many minutes we got? We got a couple minutes left. <laughs> Please don't leave me on a cliffhanger. That's all I'm asking. Please, please don't leave me on a cliffhanger, please. Holy shit, what an image. Please. Please don't leave me on a cliffhanger. Fuck, it's gonna leave me on a goddamn cliffhanger. It really is, isn't it? Oh my god, it's gonna leave me on a fucking cliffhanger. Oh! Huh? What? There's more? Is there actually more? Is this it? That's- Oh, fuck off. Oh my god, okay. Alright, we can just go into the goddamn discussion now. Like- like I said... I- I'm not mad. Let's just say that. I'm not mad. I'm not. 
I had a feeling that it was gonna do this to me though. I had a feeling, and most people could have saw it coming, that they were going to do this. Oh my God. I got a headache after that episode, guys. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, man. Oh man, there's so much I could say, but really in this episode, damn, it left you asking questions. Part of me really just wants, because I have the manga right above me right now. I really do. I bought all the all the rest of the volumes. They're all up there. And I really want to pick it up and start reading. But I won't. I will not. Because I've said before, and I'll say it again, ever since day one, I am an anime only with this show. There's no probable question for me into reading the manga, let alone at this stage where next year is the final season for my hero academia the anime will end and it really doesn't make any sense for me to pick up the manga and just start reading it even if i want to find out so bad about so many questions i'm not gonna do it but where do i honestly start with this episode i could say one thing at least with this this was not the best episode in the season and I think most people can probably agree with me. Not the best episode of the season. One of the best moments in the season? You damn straight. To see All Might, number one, fighting again. Just that. And taking on All for One again. Is something that I never thought I would see again. Honestly, at this point, I thought that maybe All Might would probably die. Then again, he's on, pro on the probable cusp of death whatever happened to the next season. I heard the next season isn't even probably gonna be long. I heard it's probably going to be like half of, like probably maybe 12, 13 episodes, how you would see a normal first core. That's at least with that, but they have not confirmed that, but that's just at least me thinking about it. But wow, just to see everything with that suit was able to do, make him look, and my God, it looked like All Might was losing his effing mind, but I think it was just the fact that he was really, really embracing what was going on in the moment that he was number one fighting all for one and just to be able to have kind of like that spirit back we've seen back in season four or season five like he i think even before the war when aizawa talked with all might and all might really just sitting on that bench feeling absolutely helpless and worthless and just useless all of those words any of those words he was just feeling so down and feeling like hey these kids are about to go into this battle and go into this kind of war situation where i can't do anything to help them so even just at that point i even back then i was kind of thinking well all might is just going to be there as a kind of like a mental thing for everybody else to realize what they are fighting for and like the legend of All Might and obviously with Deku with One For All and all that. Like, I don't really know what is gonna happen in the next season and possibly the still thing where if I see All Might dying, it's a possible chance. I, I don't know. It's so, it's so unpredictable, at least with me not knowing really what's gonna kind of happen, but... I don't want to kind of forget the first half of this episode because this episode had a lot. Is Toga dead? I think that's what this episode was. She sacrificed herself, gave Uraraka all of her blood, and she's dead. Like that, that, the whole scene with the sparrow and all of that. Yeah, I think she's dead. So, unless we get, unless, I know most of you guys are probably going to go in the comments and be like, yeah, she's dead, da da da, just, just kind of just hit me with that hard kind of spoiler, even though it's not a spoiler, but clarification, if I'd say, but, man, something that I was not really kind of expecting either. I just, I have a hard time trying to think about, like, oh, who could still even die in this arc, because the only person that I see possibly dying is all for one. There is no way, and this is just me, there's no way in hell, especially with the condition that he's in right now with Rewind, there's no way in hell he is living throughout all this. There's no way. Sugar Rocky, that's a different story. I do think somehow, some way, he's probably still gonna live, but I know we're gonna save that for another time. 
Oh my God, I'm just so out of breath and I've only been talking for a little bit. My head is on fire after this episode, not knowing what the hell was going on. So much stuff happening. All Might using so many of Class 1A's quirks with that suit. I want to know how that suit was constructed by Melissa and just what it took to go into making that suit. I want to see the scenes and I hopefully think that they are going, they're, they're going to have scenes in the next season. There has to be because you got to show how that's that, how that was done. You got to show that. And it was also great to see Melissa again. It really, really was. But next season, um, at least with the, at least with the cliffhanger. Oh my God. It, it pains me, man. It really does that. I got to wait till next year for the final, final season to see everything. <sighs> what can I really say about this season? At least with that, this season has had some of the most incredible moments I've ever seen in my hero where I could just obviously name just a couple, obviously still, I think probably the number one episode in everybody can agree with me it was the episode that was trending worldwide even when the damn manga chapter came out it was still trending worldwide the bakugo episode is definitely a top 10 episode of all time in my hero definitely it is the best episode of this season everything that they did with bakugo in that episode the music the visuals animation it was beautiful it, it was beautiful and I'm so excited, and I'll say this again, I'm so excited to see how he comes back. I really, really am. And that moment next year, it's going to be something else. I don't know probably when it's going to happen, how it's going to happen. I have no idea. But the dude's going to come back, and he's going to have one hell of a moment back with Deku. That's what I can freaking guarantee the other freaking moment in the season, goddamn gear shift. Gear shift having easily the best animation in this whole season. Obviously, of course, fucking Nakamura. Nakamura is such a god at making animation in this show look like the most batshit on freaking like like you're you you feel just lost when you see his animation and it's so hard like it's it's number one so hard to like comprehend what the hell is going on but when you see it over and over again you really see what's going on he knows what he's doing and yes yeah, sometimes he makes the character so so small in his animation because everything around is freaking ginormous it's so it's a spectacle to even see that with me even seeing the my hero movie yesterday it was something else. It was something else. And I'd say that for the freaking movie that I saw in the very last moment, I think that was Nakamura's best animation that he's had by far. Like, and I know the nine fight is easily still probably one of the best fights of all time easily because you will never get over that moment of Bakugo and Deku one for all. That will just, that, that will never leave anybody's mind when they were in the theater that night. It will always be a moment that everybody will cherish. And it was, I, I, I wish that I could have seen it in theaters. I'm kind of still wishing that they would re-release some of the movies in theaters because I would have loved to see that in theaters. And it, it would have just only been a couple months after I would have got into the show. But no, this season was absolutely insane. So many goddamn returns. Gentle came back. One of my favorite moments of the entire season. Just the whole stuff with the trader was crazy. The stuff with the Todoroki family just so much that obviously I'm going to have to do another stream and who knows I may or may not have a guest but that's still at least up in the air as well just so much and do I think that this is better than season six? Oh, that's so hard to tell it's so it's guys it's so close it's so damn close because you got the top episodes that both revolve around Bakugo with the Bakugo apology and the Bakugo sacrifice. The sacrifice, I, mm, does it hit harder? I don't know. At least right now, it's still very, very close. I'd say this right now, top two seasons, season six and season seven. That's the easy thing that I can put it right here. The top two seasons. I cannot kind of say at least which one was better i'm definitely going to put it in a poll which season do you guys think was the best out of all of my hero or even between season six season seven i'm probably going to do that which is the better season 
Guys, I'm wrapping it up because I don't have that much time. Once again, I just want to say because you guys have been here, most of you guys, since the beginning. And we're going into next year. I don't know how it's really going to be done with anime, like just me editing and everything. Because a year, I'm, I'm expecting this show to come out next fall, next year. That's my prediction. But there's a lot that I want to get into. Look forward on the community tab. I will give details about a future stream in the future with my hero. I'm wrapping it up. Guys, one hell of a season. Thank you all for being here and just keep looking forward to everything else on the channel. Sorry, I've been uploading recently. I've had a lot going on, but I'm getting back into it. Don to Don, so much stuff that is going to be coming. My hero is over, but that is not the end. Guys, thank you for watching my video. If you guys are excited for the future of My Hero Academia and you guys like the channel, like, subscribe, comment down below. And as always, my name is Omsi and I am out.